The Mohawk Valley Center for the Arts in Little Falls presents Local Arts. After 17 years working as a graphic artist, Josephine Ambrose recently retired and went back to her first love of fine art. Her advertising and design degree and her fine arts education at Munson Williams Proctor are serving her well. She is sharing her love of painting in her watercolor class at the Parkway Senior Center in Utica. When I was 13, someone challenged me to, that, to paint this painting. It was Actually, I did an oil painting of Benjamin Franklin. And give me a challenge at a young age, well, I'll do it. <laughs> I like doing people, flowers, landscape. I really don't have a favorite. It's the same thing. Whatever I'm working on at the time, what I'm psyched in about, and uh, if I come back from uh, seeing another artist to, you know, a demonstration, I say, oh, wow, that's, that's fun. I'll mm -hmm. do that. If I'm into watercolors, I'll be doing one after the other. And then when I do port the, oh, the portraits, oh, the oil feels so good again. It's when I'm driving, always. I wish I could stop, and I can't because it's not anywhere you can. It's always. Mm -hmm. I always look at the view, the trees, the shadows. My favorite time is uh, late afternoon or morning. Now, that's what I stress to my students. You know, get a good light source, I suppose they do with the camera, yeah. too. Um, that, uh, that's important. Now, do you take a camera with you? The camera? I always carry a camera, always. Mm -hmm. And I've recently just put a small sketch box together to keep in my car with the intentions of stopping and doing these little quick little studies even in a, a tiny bit of watercolor on it. Josephine works in both watercolors and oils. I asked her if there were similarities. Uh, the one similarity would be values. You know you have lights and darks and the colors that you're using. I might use a little different in oil. Um, they're different. Watercolor is, to me, is very important to keep it transparent. Uh, good paper, good paints, oils, the same thing. Um, I think oil is the mixing process. I love the mixing. I'll, when I do portraits, I'll mix the skin tones ahead of time and a few off colors to tone it down. So I'll have a palette pre-mixed before I start uh, doing a, a portrait demo. I just love it playing. I mean, I was a graphic artist for, for 17 years at the newspaper, and that kind of helped also because you're thinking more of design and how you, you know, if you're going to put some wording into something. In fact, one of my students likes to do poetry with her watercolors, and it, uh, it, it revolves, I think. I'm learning. I'm always learning. When you're, when you're teaching, you're learning. Because, no. you know, you just have to go back to what you've learned when you were younger and you have to refresh yourself and your students and keep them inspired and it's just a constant um, learning experience. I love it. You can take classes with Josephine at the Parkway Senior Center at 220 Memorial Parkway in Utica. You can see some of her artwork at Brookdale Senior Living at Villas Sherman Brook, just off Kellogg Road in Clinton. So what's real?